how do you find a balance to explain something like computer science to all of us? Like, what's the key element in teaching? I don't know if I can, like, do you get what is? I do. I'm sorry, I'm I do. Nervous. <laughs> no, thank you for the kind words. Um, it's not easy, and I don't know if we do a great job all of the time, but I think the simple answer is empathy and remembering what it was like to not understand material yourself and remembering what it was like to feel like everyone else in the room or in the class was smarter than you or knew better the material and to try to put yourself into the shoes, so to speak, of that student to help them with a narrative, both verbally and in the course's homework assignments and slides and so forth, get from the, the starting line, so to speak, to the finish line without like letting go of their hand during that process. And I think it takes practice. I think it takes uh, sensitization. For instance, even though this course CS50 happens to be taught um, to our uh, college undergraduates at Harvard, I first got my start teaching um, in a lectureship role at Harvard's Extension School, which is a much broader demographic of students, uh, young students, old students, everyone in between uh, who have gone or who have not gone to college. And so it was a much more diverse audience of students, both in Cambridge and online. And I think that too helped sensitize me to different learning styles. I think we have always, I have always had students who are of very different um, backgrounds, geographically, socioeconomically, uh, academically. And I think that helps too, not assuming that your student body is all of the same type or of the same mindset. So in short, empathy. 